Hey everyone, so I come again with a new, um, well I don't come again, I come with a new hairstyle for you guys and this one's going to be inspired for Valentine's Day. Of course you can use this style for um, a daily basis if you would like, but today I'm doing it for Valentine's Day and it's actually a look I'm wearing right now. So it looks like this. I love that brooch now. Um, there's few items that you're going to need to create this look. And let me um, bring them for you guys. Okay, so I know quickly I put on my earrings because I found them. I was like, wait, I knew I was, I was going to prepare for this video. And I took off my earrings because I was putting on my clothes and stuff. And I was like, something was missing when I was seeing the video thingy. And I was like, what's missing? And then my earrings are missing. So these are the earrings I put on. And I think they're just so cute. They have like a little heart with whatever that is. Okay, so you're going to need elastic, and I chose a clear one just because um, I want it to be hidden, kind of thing. Bobby pins, and a teasing brush. Um, this is not, like, for teasing kind of thing, but I use it for it because I don't have a specific teasing. And a hairspray. And, of course, a little brooch to... Um, I don't know, just, <laughs> well, to make it look more pretty and elegant looking. Like, you know, yeah, so let's get on with the hairstyle. Hope you guys like it, and let's get on to it. Okay, guys, so let's get up to it. Okay, just for time, because I do not have a time right now. It's like 11 o'clock. Um, this braid here that I did, it's just a regular braid, and it's hidden. It's tied with an elastic, and then I put some bobby pins and hid it underneath here. And then I kind of, I kind of overlapped it like this, so the bobby pins and the hair tie will be, um, not visible. And then all I did, it's like a really pretty braid. And I'm going to make, um, I'm going to be making a separate video of how to do this look. I mean, this braid because it's very time consuming, and I have the time, I don't have all the time in the world, so we're gonna skip that. But I'm gonna make a separate video, so if you guys wanna actually learn how I did it, you can go watch that. But for now, so I've done the braid, and then time for teasing. I already have my part because of this braid right here, so I'm just going to get the hair that's falling back. I'm going to get the front section. And teasing, is, I think, is a good choice because it just adds some volume. It's a lot of fun, and you can go crazy with it. Well, not that crazy, but yeah. Let's give it a spray and just start teasing. Spray, and then I'm going to spread the teeth. Same with this one. Just work with it. And lightly just start smoothing it out. Not really like wanting to comb up comb it out, just kind of smooth out the top. Perfect. So you got you got your volume, then you just want to get the hair, put in a big poof. And give it a spray yeah and then just let it sit there for a while with the poof I feel like snooky so what's in, once it's like you can feel it and it's kind of dry I'm gonna release it that's the little thing I like to do and it just gives that it like the volume and the tea stays right so the next thing you want to do it's got a few sections from here, and I'm just going to tease it really lightly, like this. Really lightly, not really nothing. Right? Okay. Oh my god, how do I look with short hair? Would I look cute with short hair? I was thinking I'm cutting it really, really short, but then I, I backed out. I chickened out. Hope that looks pretty in camera. Alright, anyways, so I'm gonna get the section. I'm going to give it a twist. Oh, and by the way, this is a little close up of, uh, of the brooch. If you guys weren't able to see it good, this is the brooch and this is the tie. So it's beautiful. I love it. Thumbs up for the brooch. Alright, so then I'm just gonna start twisting. Just do like a random twist. 
and then after you twisted it, you just want to hold it, and do the same with the other side. Alright, so before you connect it, I'm just going to give it the volume, so I will definitely lose this volume right here, because I want the beautiful volume. Alright, so there you go, I just kind of lifted it up, and now I'm just going to attach the brooch in. No, actually I'm going to get my elastic, here I go. And tie those together. So you, there you can see elastic, right? Okay, so next step, we're still going to need the bobby pins anyway, so gonna get it and you just this one's a cute one you just snap open whoa <laughs> just place it and ta-da I, I don't think you need the lolly pins never mind bring your hair forward and then if you lost a little bit of the volume just push it up with your fingers ta-da that was so easy it took me like it took me six minutes to get this look done so you guys can do it out there and I don't know I feel it's very really elegant looking don't you think like I love it um so yeah so this is my fun elegant Valentine's um hairstyle for you guys I love it I love the end result and please comment rate and subscribe and I wish you guys all subscriber or not subscriber um, the best Valentine's Day of the year 2011, which I'm so excited of. <laughs> Alright, so see you guys later. Have a great Valentine's Day. Take care.